Hey guys, this tutorial is just for fun, but you might find it useful. I'm going to show you how to make your eyes look like the Incredible Hulk. Like I said, this is just a fun tutorial, but the concepts can help you with changing eye colors in a more dynamic way than just one single color. It's fast, it's simple, and it's non-destructive. You will hear that term a lot as you learn Photoshop. Learn how to work with your images as non-destructively as possible, or in layman's terms, how to make changes to them without affecting the original image. It can save a lot of pain and time in the long run. So what we're going to do is grab the pen tool. We're going to zoom in as much as we can. It's about 100%. That's great. And we're going to mask around the eye. Now, I'm going to mask around this eye in, in curves. And the way I'm going to do that is press and hold whenever I click. And that will literally create a curved point rather than a straight point. Now, of course, the more straight points you create, uh, the less it will matter whether or not it's curved. But for a round part like this eye, it can be really helpful. And there we go. We have our eye masked. Now we're going to right click and s click the button make selection and we're going to make sure our feather radius is at about 5 pixels. The larger the eye, the more pixel radius you want. Press OK. Now we're going to press Command and Control C and Command and Control V to copy and paste a new layer and it's just the eye. See how the feather really helps? That's going to be really helpful for you later on. Just makes it so you don't have to worry about it looking fake or unrealistic. We're going to name this green. And we're going to go up to layer, new adjustment layer, hue and saturation. And press OK. And then press this little button right here. And that makes it so this is only affecting the green eye. Very, very important that you do that. Adjustment layers also make it so you can make adjustments to the colors and contrast and whatever to the layer without affecting it permanently. You can always take this off or delete it. Now go to the hue and adjust it till it becomes Hulk green, right about there. Not ridiculously green, that's jade green. Hulk green's about there. Now up the saturation so you can really see it. There we go. And you can play around the lightness, but don't do it too much because that'll create that and that's no good. So I'm actually bringing down the lightness a little bit. It adds contrast, makes it more interesting. Now, take this layer and duplicate it. And we're going to put it above the adjustment layers. Reconnect our hue and saturation layer to our green eye. And you notice that it's gone. That's because this green copy is covering it. So I'm going to name this yellow. And I'm going to add another adjustment layer. Same thing, hue and saturation. Make sure this is linked only to this bottom layer here. And adjust the hue so it looks yellow. Right there is where it is. Up the saturation. And that's pretty good. Now what we're going to do is take the yellow eye layer, and we're going to add a layer mask, and we're going to invert it. Then we're going to take our brush tool, make sure it's white, set the opacity at 100%, flow at 100%, and make sure the hardness is very low. And we're going to brush around the center of the eye, creating this little bit of yellow. Because if you look closely at Hulk eyes in the movies, especially the Incredible Hulk, he's got yellow, yellow centers to his eye. Now don't make it perfect, get little pieces here and there that are more yellow than others. And that's pretty good. Now what we want to do is add a little bit more definition to this. We're going to grab the burn tool and we're just going to paint a little bit of darkness around the ends of his eyes. And that just helps it give it more definition. Now let's zoom back out to normal. We have some pretty good Incredible Hulk eyes here. So let's see. Here's before. 
and after. Again, before and after. It's pretty cool. And it's really nice because it gives you two separate layers and you can add as many layers as you want and experiment with different types of things to create artistic effects. Just this one in particular is kind of a Hulk eyes effect. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any specific requests that you would like to see for touch-ups or enhancements, please send me an email to requests at mahalo.com. And please also be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe below.